Hi, this is Nick from Buddy Gaming, gaming with a dash of chill. Since this is my intro video, I think it's only appropriate to talk a little about myself and my background, maybe get a better understanding of who I am and possibly where we could go with this channel in the future. Um, I've been gaming since around the mid to late 80s. Obviously, in that time, I've seen a lot of change, a lot of things come and go, a lot of innovations. Uh, myself and my brother have always had consoles, or I should say computers. Um, so back in the day we had uh, the Atari, the Spectrum ZX, the Amigas, uh, the Commodore 64. Later on we moved on to the more traditional home consoles like the Nintendo and the Mass System. Followed by the Super Nintendo and the Mega Drive. So gaming's always been a really important part of my life and that hasn't changed much. Uh, even till recent, I'm still a gamer. However, I do have uh, I do have a family to think about and work. So any time that's not spent with my kids or at work, I like to get my downtime is always gaming console related. Even uh, you know looking up YouTube videos and, and such things like that, reading up about favorite um, my favorite games in development. So gaming is a very important part of my life. Um, I game on the PlayStation systems and I would just like to make a distinction between being a fan of the PlayStation versus being a fanboy of the PlayStation. To myself a fanboy is someone who spends the majority of the time uh, denouncing the opposing consoles, i.e. the Nintendos and the Microsofts and any negative news that they find on them that you know that that makes a fanboy happy and you know I, I mean this is just my opinion I find that very toxic I don't think that really helps at all I don't think the gaming community kind of needs another one of those voices we have plenty of them about and they would do that much better than I could do I personally have respect uh, for both Nintendo and Microsoft I think they're both excellent um, companies uh, I'd be Completely lying. I'd be oh, sorry. I'd, I'd be on. I'd be lying if I didn't say I do have a few faults with Nintendo. However, I do recognise them as master craftsmen in, in 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 their own right in terms of the games that they make. And um, sometimes it's just the decisions a company make kind of I suppose alienate me a bit as a gamer. That being said, I can see um, I can see great IPs on all platforms including the PC it's just for time and for financial reasons I pick one platform and I stick to it unless I say that platform stops offering me what I want from gaming um, the same was originally true with Nintendo I used to be a big Nintendo fan and then over the years I got very disenfranchised by it um, and I found myself less and less interested in the consoles and Sony came along at the right time and the PlayStation happened and the rest is history. I've owned every PlayStation console since, including handhelds. Um, I've had a lot of enjoyment. There's obviously things on any console that you know, I'd, be, um, I'd be remiss if I didn't say well that's imperfect, but on whole, that's where I enjoy gaming. Um, I think a little about the games that I personally like, just to get a better idea about what kind of gamer I am. Um, back in the day, started on my Mario's and my Sonic's and flashbacks and um, loved games like uh, California games and uh, what else? I loved uh, Toad Jam and Earl, some brilliant games. Uh, Alex the Kid, Kid Chameleon. Uh, got really into my platformers, loved things like Jack and Dexter, Ratchet and Clank, um, not so much Spyro, Sly Cooper. Um, the Uncharted franchise to me is just um, almost an untouchable franchise to me at this point. I think almost anything Naughty Dog Turn the Hand to turns out to be gold. Same with The Last of Us. Uh, the Batman Arkham series, uh, amazing. Um, I used to I used to really enjoy the Assassin's Creed series, but of late I'm finding quite a bit of gamer fatigue with that. Especially Unity, I don't know what it is with Unity, you know, it's a very pretty game, but 
I just don't get the same enjoyment that I used to. I don't know whether it's a game mechanic thing or what. Um, I've been trying to expand my horizons a bit, no pun intended. Um, I love uh, a lot of my Vita games, uh, Guacamelee, a lot of uh, the indie titles, uh, Hotline Miami, um, what else? Uh, uh, Musumara Rebirth, I think I butchered that name. Um, obviously, games like The Last of Us, uh, Horizon Zero Dawn, it was amazing first uh, entry into a new IP, with many more to look forward to, i.e. Spider-Man, God of War, Days Gone, um, Hellblade, Rhyme, so it's a very good time to be a gamer. So that's just a little about myself and the kind of things I like. Um, in terms of direction, I want to get some different voices on my channel, uh, possibly looking and a certain maybe my own podcast with some cool people who, who can kind of be like-minded gamers but not necessarily agree with everything I have to say in terms of the negativity and uh, just keeping it about gaming not about drama um, so that's really what I'm focusing on I'm trying to make it a more posit positive kind of environment just to have an open flat platform for discussions about what we think about gaming where it could go um, you know, lots of fun topics like that. So that's Nick from Buddy Gaming. Thank you for stopping by and taking the time out to listen to the video. I hope the day finds you well. And take care, guys.